so the Kodiak cell generator is going to what I call the equalizing state again and I'll let it equalize. It is at 11.65 volts and the AGM battery is 11.60 volts. So the Kodiak generator is very efficient in discharging the AGM battery. Closing there. So it's saying that this is a, a battery state charge for AGM battery, and it's saying 11.60 volts. 20% of its life and you really shouldn't run a AGM level that low. I may just disconnect it to protect my AGM because I'm I'm literally in the state of hurting my AGM battery. This is a battery state of charge and I'm 11.60, 20%. I gotta think about this. I'm running the vacuum cleaner again. The voltage on the battery raised itself up to 11.70. The only way that this could possibly happening is that the internal batteries of the internal cells of the batteries don't all discharge at the same rate and uh, the cells next to the terminal take the power out in uh, positive and negative those two terminals they discharge a lot and that's of course what we measure because that's what the terminal is but the internal batteries of the Kodiak generator are still high, high, highly charged and as we let it equalize they they bring that power to the to the positive and negative leads and we are on four four lights four green lights which It's a lot of power. So there's no lacking of power for the Kodiak generator. It's just a matter of it's not able to deliver the power to the real world. I'm going to turn it on again and vacuum some more. This time, this time. This time the Kodiak solar generator started this cycle that it does at uh, about six minutes. So the duration between the duration between being able to run and being able to have to shut down is decreasing. And I'm not giving it as much time to equalize the batteries. I want to get this jo job of vacuuming, vacuuming the vent over with. So I'm going to push it. I don't think I'm hurting the 
vacuum cleaner and I don't think I'm hurting the Kodiak. The Kodiak is reading 11.51 volts and my AGM battery is reading 11.50 so it's 10 percent so the A AGM battery has only 10 percent energy in it that's what it says battery state of charge AGM 11 11.50 so I am definitely putting my AGM battery to a complete cycle of just discharge and I've basically doing this I've taken one life cycle out of my AGM battery so the Kodiak energy could not could not support the the vacuum cleaner so it went into safe mode again we're saying we got 11.30 volts in the Kodiak okay still not zero on the AGM still have some energy it was down to two lights but now it's on it was down to one light one green light but now it's up to two green lights I got one more little section to vacuum clean. I wait till the left end. Wait till the left left end uh, turns off, and then I will vacuum the last section. I'm going to vacuum the last section of the van that I have to do. Get some three lights. The left end is uh, off I'm gonna turn on the vacuum cleaner and finish the last section we'll see what's left of the battery for as far as the AGM battery it's at 11.33 so it's below the 10% going close to zero but I'm not gonna disconnect it I figure I'll let it, leave it on, run it down, let the uh, solar panel charge it up partially today, and, and uh, when I run the vent tomorrow, we'll charge it up both batteries full. So. I'm gonna start up the vacuum cleaner. Hopefully, I'll finish this time. Ah! It went into safety mode again. So, I'll turn it off, turn it on. The Kodak Energy. Kodiak solar generator just shot itself off again. No more than three minutes. I didn't get to finish all I'm going to vacuum clean, but that's it. I'm done for today. So it's saying that it's at 11.11 volts. 11.11 volts. Not too good for my AGM battery. It's connected to the solar generator, so I will just watch it charge. Confuse mode, guys. Confuse mode. It's moving power internally. It's not able to to move power to the external world where we need it. I gotta say, this is a failure of the Kodiak generator.
So I didn't even get a chance to go vacuum and it went into this mode that it does. And it's saying one or two, three lights. What it's done for, it's gonna shut down. It's at 10.97 volts just below, just above my 0M, just below the zero level for my AGM battery. So I'm calling it quits. That's as far as I'm vacuum cleaning. It has plenty of power, but it just can't deliver. You can see this flesh, this, this area of flesh. It's saying that it moved 1,200 watts at one time. That was its peak. So, I guess for Christmas, I need to buy myself a less M vacuum cleaner, like a 6M vacuum cleaner or 8M vacuum cleaner because this 12M vacuum cleaner is just too much for this Codex solar generator.